Hey everybody, welcome back to Subgaming with James. So, we got the new Garrison system today. So, I know a lot of people are confused, I'm getting lots of messages, so let's go over it. The Garrison system is about to be upgraded to the Hero Position system. More conveniently, you can appoint and switch heroes directly. No need to cancel Garrison on buildings, more centralized. The same effects will be given to the same position. You don't need to separately set the heroes to Garrison buildings, more powerful. Simultaneously, support at most three heroes to have the same attributes. More hum uh, You can appoint or dismiss heroes even when the building is functioning. More information added to compare attribute functions for appointing and dismissing heroes. More useful heroes can constantly gain EXP experience when under appointment. So it does not consume EXP. You gain EXP. I know that's another thing that people have been complaining about. They think it's going to take away their EXP. You're not taking it away. I've tested it throughout the day. You do gain the EXP. Alright, so that's that. So give me just one second and let me jump into my castle. Alright, so now we're in the castle. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, um, comment down below with any questions or concerns you might have and I'll try and help the best I can. So let's go over here. So this is what we got. Governor, construction officer, resource officer, research scholar, doctor, recruitment officer, and guardian knight. So the best thing to do is basically just kind of open it up and see what attributes are listed. So the governor, it's basically, think of it as the drill grounds. Okay, so uh, upper limit marching troops, attack monster speed, marching speed, troop load. Um, so she's pretty much naked. Okay, so what I'm doing, I'm not going to use my orange material because I'm saving that to finish my Asylum set. So what I'm doing is I'm just using my low level stuff. Um, I think I'm actually doing blue right now. Okay, we'll finish this up. So you're gonna wanna do this for each, each hero. See, so this one's troop load, troop load. Um, a lot of what most people have been complaining about is their march speed and their hospital capacity. So, as you can see, we're going here. Uh, troop load increase. So it's 10%, but now we'll jump in here and we'll go to her, we're working on that armor. So she go up 14%. See plus, now we're up to plus 28, 27.8. So that's what you want to do with with the governor. March speed, troop load, march size. Construction officer, basically building speed. Um, let's... So, see, so she's gaining a thousand EXP every hour and it is working. Um, if you notice, like right now it's on Bernard, so 
So if I was to garrison Bernard, you can see my troop size, my march size would go down, march speed's gonna go down, and my troop load increase is also gonna go down. So that's another handy little thing. Uh, basically this one is basically just building speed, that's it. Resource officer. So, this one's gathering resource. Uh, resource production. And gathering speed, that's about it. Research Scholar, basically it's the same thing as Garrus and the hero on your college. So it's research speed. Um, the doctor, stamina recovery, healing speed, hospital capacity. Okay, hospital capacity, it's only the hospital capacity percentage. So what you get from the equipment. Okay, so a lot of us had, like him, I'll show you. He was my hero that I garrisoned on the castle. Over here in support. So this, 5,000. extra 20,000 that isn't there anymore and that's what a lot of people are complaining about because their hospital capacity decreased so hopefully this is something they'll fix recruitment officer um, the nice thing about this is you can put one of your heroes in here on support for the training speed and it will give you the bonus for all troops instead of having to garrison on say your range to do archers or your barracks to do infantry this will do all four and he has the full mercy set so that's why he's on there and if we go back in here if you look at the very very bottom there's your hospital capacity, but activate hero two. Now, if you look up here, unlock when you reach admire popularity. So basically you gotta get way down here before you can, there you go. You gotta get past friendly, Go all the way through respect and then there you go when you get to there you can get that second hero and then you'll get your hospital cap back so hospital capacity also healing speed and stamina recovery. This one here, this is your wall. So if you guys are in war or you're on defense, um, ancient battlefield, mineral vein, um, the kill event, kingdom versus kingdom, this is your wall. So a lot of people don't have all the heroes. I actually just finished getting the Viking hero this morning and I switched back to Yomada. So I actually have all the heroes right now. Um, it's also the monster stage. So the other cool thing is you can go through here, 
So we're gonna be killing monsters. We're gonna retire her. level 23 so we're gonna retire both of these who else do we got he's maxed to 25 she's maxed to 25 let's take him off Tire him. Let's grab Bernard. Tire him. So you got to keep track of what heroes go where. And like I said, so you're gonna have to go go through, figure out where do you want your heroes. Figure out what attributes are listed, and then you're gonna sort of like Salem right now. Um, basically, this is the drill grounds. So I want that March size bonus. But I also need the troop load and the march speed. So I'll be going through here and building any piece of equipment I can for probably blue for now until I get equipment on all my naked heroes. Uh, so there's a level 40 troop load, march speed. March speed. The capacity. So I'll basically be going through here. Oh, let's go to the boot. Oh, hey, this one right here, perfect. This boot right here, the rose boot. It's triple march speed. So that is definitely one that we will build for Salem to equip on her, because we we're gonna we're gonna need to make that march speed up. So even even if you got troops training, college is researching. You know, whatever the case may be, you can pull your heroes off anytime. Kill monsters so they get the EXP. With the monsters, and then when you're done killing monsters, just put them back so they get that hourly bonus. So I know like the new the new three heroes, Joseph. They max out at level 25, but you can still get some kind of bonus from having them, plus putting the equipment on them. And putting them in there. Because it's it's all gonna add up. So anyways, I hope that helped. Like I said, comment down below if you have any questions. Um, there's a lot of people that's confused. Like I said, the biggest issue right now is the march speed and everybody's hospital capacity went down because we don't actually get the bonus from having our heroes in support. Um, anyways, thanks for watching. Um, comment down below, I'll reply, and we'll figure this out together. I finished up on these monsters real quick.
Okay, so there's my stamina. So as you can see, you still get the hero EXP from the monsters. Now, let's jump back in here. Deny him out of stamina. We're gonna actually rally some rebels, leaders here in just a sec. But I don't need my heroes for that. She didn't come back yet. Where is she? <laughs> All right. Let me wait a couple seconds for those to come back. Let's go in here. All right, you guys see that, right? We have 643. So every day, we go in there and we spend a hundred SBIP. Maybe we'll get lucky today. Oh, hundred. Where'd they go? There you go, there's 400 right there. There's another 700. Jump back in here. Oh, we gotta come back in here. So it changes them from the box to uh, right there. There we go. And just like that, up to 18. So that's it, you just come in here and collect that box for 100 every day, open them individually. All right, all are back. Now we're gonna come back in here. You put them all back on so they get the hourly bonus. Uh, construction, let's do doctor, him, recruitment officer, Jared, that's Bernard, all right now, who do we got here? That one's friendly plus three. Yeah. But. All right, there we go. See, just like that. Now they're all getting an EXP minus the queen. Oh my goodness.
Well, there you have it. There's your new hero positions. Like I said, just take take what heroes you have. Figure out where you want to use them. Try and set up the skill for that. And you got to build the, the right set of equipment to enhance it. Anyways, thanks for watching.